Okay, we go now to the computation of moment of inertia. So, yung moment of inertia daw, na pag-aaral natin sa conceptualization, incidentally, ano, gagamit na lang ako ng whiteboard kasi mas mabilis ito kasi itong moment of inertia puro integral ito. Eh, doon sa screen na screen narration medyo mabagal dahil uh, mouse lang yung gamit eh bumabagal din yung uh, uh, pag uh, solve natin kailangan kasi sa sa pag solve ng integral may uh, tinatawag tayong momentum din ano? hindi po pwede rin yung uh, patigil-tigil para mabilis yung uh, pacing ng ating uh, ng ating pag-iisip uh, okay So, uh, pag-aaralan natin yun dito, moment of inertia. Yung moment of inertia is the ability of the body to resist any change in its angular uh, velocity. Kasi nga, yung uh, inertia is uh, defined as the uh, ability of the body to resist change in uh, uh, velocity. Eh, yung moment of inertia, angular velocity naman yung uh, ngayon uh, halimbawa mas marami daw moment of inertia ang isang object the more moment of inertia an object has the harder it would be to start it from rotating kasi nga diba yung uh, ay natin teka kuha tayo ng mas malinaw-linaw kasi nga yung I natin daw is equal to m r squared ganyan o kaya meron din tayo dyang uh, formula na I is equal to the summation of m1 r1 squared uh, so to ano bang ibig sabihin ano, ano? for example meron daw tayong isang uh, object, however irregular it is, if we want to root, to get the moment of inertia about this axis here, or let's say this is point O, okay, and we have here a mass M, M1, and we have here mass M2, and we have here R1, ito naman yung R2, ito yung point O, ang pagkuha daw ng moment of inertia niyan is simply equal to I is equal to the summation of M R squared. Yung I daw natin dito is equal from 1 to N. O oh, yan. Is our starting point from M M1 to MN. Ngayon, kapag ka-rigid yung object, napag-aralan na rin naman natin kung ano ibig sabihin ng rigid. Yung rigid ay uh, solid object na kapag nag-rotate ay uh, syempre sabay-sabay. So, uh, there will be millions or billions of particles in that object. And, uh, hindi natin makukuha yun na uh, mga masses, no? Ano? So, sobrang dami ng mass. For example, we have this uh, first example um, by the way, meron nga pala sa mga aklat na mga ibinibigay na mga formulas ng moment of inertia kaya lang walang derivation ngayon, I will derive some of it and uh, give you an example pero yung iba noon the rest will be your will be your responsibility to uh, to compute para ano ninyo, ano? para uh, in the ring part no? <clears throat> for example meron tayong uh, rod for example we have this rod okay kuha tayo medyo malinaw linaw na pencil pen and uh, for example that rod has the length L total length down yan ay L and We, are, we want to rotate it about this axis. We are going to rotate it about this axis in a counterclockwise direction. So, 
sa sobrang dami ng mas niyan, hindi naman natin po pwedeng kwentahin yan. What, what mathematicians intend to do is to, uh, is to use, to use integration. Okay? Kapag nag integrate tayo, ano bang idea ng integration nga pala? Uh, yun yung pagsasama-sama ng uh, isang bagay, ano? For example, itong rod na to, kumukuha tayo ng isang uh, maliit na strip or yung tinatawag natin uh, small mass element or sa calculus, ang tawag natin doon elementary strip. For example, here, we will get a strip that is, we say, uh, dm. That strip is called dm. O, imag ipalakihin natin dito, no? Kung yan yun, yun yung isang buo, okay, kukuha tayo ng elementary strip, representative strip, at tatawagin natin daw siyang dm. Okay. So, that is the uh, representative of the infinite uh, mass. And for example, we have it here from this rotation to this elementary strip dm here. Okay. And we call that as our r. Okay. R daw yung distansya magmula rito hanggang dito. Sometimes, if you want to call that x, edi pwede rin naman x ang itawag mo. But here we call it r. Now, kung worry daw yung... Uh, yung thickness ng strip na yun, eh, dr. Okay? So, dr yan, ano? Yung thickness. So, this is L over 2. And uh, from, if we are going to rotate it from here to here, so that will be L over 2. And this one is another L over 2. So, paano ang gagawin natin dyan, ano? So, uh, this elementary strip, ang sabi daw sa atin, ang formula daw ng moment of inertia will be equal to I is equal to the integral of R squared dm. Okay. Pero in that dm is the representative of a uh, small mass element. And the limit will be from 0 to the total uh, mass of that element. Kasi nga, ang tawag natin dyan, uh, moment of mass, yung ibang tawag natin dyan. Ano? So, paano ngayon natin i-integrate yan? For example, we are going to rotate it in uh, this axis. So, we have this R. This is R. Okay. We have I is equal to the integral of R squared. But what is dm? Yan, yung dm na yan ang ating uh, bibigay na sikreto sa inyo. No? Maraming aklat hindi pinapakita to At saka maraming, uh, maraming books. Uh, basta binibigay na lang yung formula ng moment of inertia. Ngayon, uh, siyempre, sa mga studies natin sa mga theory of equations at saka sa mga advanced learning, impart ko na sa inyo ganitong kaaga pa lang sa physics. etong dm na to, for example, uh, the representative mass element dm over the total mass is equal to, for example, the elementary strip x or whatever it is over the total length dm over m pwede ko rin naman sabihin na dm eh, if we have a differential area okay, over the total area pwede ko rin naman din na sabihin ng dm niya as uh, the uh, differential volume over the total volume. Okay. 
So, uh, pwede ko rin sabihin na nasa differential angle over the total angle. So, paano ba ang ibig sabihin natin? Yan. Itong concept na to, napaka-importante nito sa pag-i-integrate natin. Kasi nga, we are going to integrate all of the masses of this object. No matter how irregular it is. Ano? So, we are going to rotate it about an axis with an uh, elementary strip. And that dm over m uh, must be uh, discussed thoroughly. Ano? Halimbawa, uh, in this case, kukuha, buhayin muna natin ito. Ano? Magbigay muna tayo ng example. So, ang formula ng... Uh, ng integral will be uh, i is equal to the integral of r squared dm wherein dm is equal to the uh, uh, small mass element okay, representation now ang sabi natin if the, the differential mass is equal to the total mass and that is uh, for example uh, we have the differential uh, differential length L or in this case we, we call that the differential length dr and that must be equal to the total length kasi itong dr na to yun yung thickness nito but we are going to integrate it from here up to here but that one is equal to to L, no? So, yan. Ganyan yun. If we want to get dm, dm is equal to cross multiply m over L dr. So, yan. m over L dr. So, tandaan natin yung ating mga formulas na yan, ano? So, we erase this now. So, let us erase this now and have some space. Okay. Now, so, uh, ito pala yung ating dm. Kapag ka rewrite natin to, it will be i is equal to the integral of r squared. But what is dm? Pasok natin itong dm dito. Uh, times m over l dr ayun na ang mangyayari dyan ano? m over l dr ngayon i uh, ano natin yung limit i uh, determine natin yung limit if we are rotating from here let us uh, say that this is point o so this is 0 to what is this one? L over 2. Okay. From 0 to L over 2. Pero, kailangan mo siyang i-multiply sa 2 dahil sa dalawa yan. Ano? Or, meron ka rin pwedeng gawin from L over 2 to negative L over 2. Kasi nga yung limit na yan, kukunin mo yung buong buong uh, mas noong buong uh, object na yon, E eh, dito tayo nagro-rotate. So, dalawang bagay lang. Ano? Gagamitin mo lang yung techniques na uh, natututunan natin sa mga integral calculus. Yung limits, pwede mong gawin dito. Huwag mo na nang pahirapan yung sarili mo. This will be from 0 to L over 2, but you have to multiply that by 2. So, we have to multiply this by 2. Or kung gusto mo naman, ngayon yung 2, constant yun, pwede natin ilabas yun, ano? That is the constant. Uh, hindi naman natin i-integrate yun. Meron din isang bagay, uh, pwede mong uh, pahirapan pa sa sarili mo, from L over 2, from uh, negative L over 2, to L over 2. Now, uh, wow, wala na yung turi ito. So, huwag na natin pahirapan yung sarili natin. 
Uh, ganun lang, ano, pinapaulit-ulit ko yung slow motion na yung pag integrate natin, ano. So, uh, we are integrating from here up to here. That is from 0 to L over 2. But, we are only covering the half. Yung kalahati pa lang na integrate natin. Ang makukwenta lang natin hanggang dito. So, we have to multiply that by 2. Okay now. But this M over L is constant. So, we can... Uh, we can take it out and we say i is equal to uh, 2m over l okay and then we are now ready to integrate this will be r uh, squared dr yan inilabas na po natin ano ngayon po paano ba natin gagawin yan ito na so uh, pwede ko nang burahin siguro to I can erase this. So we go here now and we say that i is equal to uh, 2m over l. We now integrate. What's the integral of this one? Of course, this one is from 0 to l over 2. Ano? The integral of this r squared is r cubed over 3 from 0 to L over 2. Ngayon, we will uh, we will uh, substitute the limits, the upper limit minus the lower limit, lagi naman ganun, but yung lower limit natin, 0 na yan. Ha? So, it will be 2M over L and then L cube over 24, bali L cube over 8, tapos over 3 pa, 24, minus 0 na yun, ano? minus 0, and that will be our uh, case. Now, L here will cancel out, maliwanag o, oh. cancel out, may matitirang L squared doon, and 2 will cancel out, may matitirang 12 dito, so I is equal to, uh, m l squared over 12. So, yan yung ating uh, ganda ng ating sulat. Ano? Yan yung ating uh, derivation ng formula. i is equal to m l squared over 12. Okay. I hope uh, nasundan ninyo. So, uh, tandaan mo lang kapag nag uh, ka ng moment of inertia, kahit parehong object yan, for example, itong pentel pen na to, that is the uh, cylinder, eh, iba yung moment of inertia niya rito, iba rin yung moment of inertia niya about, rotated about this axis, ano? Uh, magkaiba yun. Kasi nga, if you will try to uh, notice, it will be very hard for me to rotate this when I am rotating it about uh, this uh, end sa dulo. Why? Uh, kasi nga, ang bigat na nun. No? Ang bigat na nung iikuti natin. Whereas here, the moment of inertia is uh, lesser. Okay. So, sa mga ganitong uh, symmetrical na bagay, katulad ng halimbawa, symmetrical itong uh, pentel pen, the less, the least moment of inertia will be on the center. And Doon sa dulo, doon yung greatest moment of inertia kasi nga m i is equal to m r squared. Habang lumalayo tayo doon sa doon sa axis of rotation, eh, lumalaki yung moment of inertia. Okay? So, uh, yan yung mga pag-solve natin. Ano? So, para mas lalong maintindihan, mag-solve tayo ng isang bagay, ay we solve, uh, ang gawin nyo na lang, uh, para makuha nyo yung notes, i-post nyo na lang yung video, tapos, uh, copyahin na lang yung, yung notes, ano, uh, yun ang kagandahan naman sa video. Now, uh, let us, uh, take for example, this very same, uh, this very same rod here. Uh, 
and this is L. Siya pa rin, parehong pareho, ito pa rin yung uh, DR at ito yung uh, itong buong ito DM. Yung length na yun DR, but we are going to rotate it about this axis here. Okay, let us uh, say for example, we are rotating it about this axis. And we call from here to here as our R. Okay, now. And we are rotating it about that. So, paano gagawin natin dyan yan? So, parehas pa rin. I is equal to what? The integral of uh, R squared dm. Okay. Ano naman ang magiging uh, pagkakaiba ngayon? Kung ito yung zero natin, this will be L. So, ang mangyayari from zero to L. Eh, wala na tayong kailangan pang i-multiply sa 2 kasi nga dito na natin siya inurotate but ang limits natin is from 0 to L it will cover the whole 9 yards of this uh, mass. Okay? So, yun lang naman ang idea nyo. Yung isang strip na yun, representative. You will uh, be integrating it all throughout this length. So, the limit is from 0 to the total length L. Okay? But what is our dm? Ang sabi natin, ito yung nakakalimot, dm over m is equal to uh, huh? dr, in that case, uh, that is the uh, representative length over the total l. So dm is equal to m over l dr. So if we're going to uh, substitute it here, I is equal to the integral of from 0 to L uh, R squared M over L dr. And if we are going to simplify it further, we have it I as the integral of from 0 to L. So we are going to take out, we are going to take out this as constant m over l, the integral of r squared from 0 to l. Then, meron tayong dr. Now, if we are going to uh, continue our... So, i here will be equal to what? m over l. We integrate now. This will be r cubed over 3 from 0 to L. Therefore, I is equal to M over L. And that will be L cubed over L cubed over 3 minus 0. Zero na yan. So, I is equal to cancel itong L dito. Minatirang. So, M L squared over 3. That will be our ML squared over 3. Masyadong mataba pala itong aking uh, rental pen. So, that will be over 3. Okay? So, I hope by now, na one in you principle sa moment of inertia, kahit parehong body, pag sa ibang axis mo uh, in rotate, it will have a different moment of inertia. Okay. The farther it is from the axis of rotation, the greater the moment of inertia. Okay, I hope by now, uh, mayroon na tayong dalawang na i-integrate. Siguro magbigay pa tayo ng mga dalawa pa and then uh, magbibigay ako ng mga plates, plates sa inyo na uh, pagsosolve ng mga composite na uh, irregular shape. Uh, magagamit nyo rito yung mga natutunan nyo sa or yung mga natutunan nyo sa integral calculus na uh, revolution tsaka dun sa mga ring method yan uh, applicable na applicable po rito okay. so uh, this is just for uh, symmetrical mag uh, we erase this now we pause for a while and I will erase this now <coughs> 
Okay, we solve now for a flat disk. Ay, mga CD, ano? Ayan. Kunwari, meron tayong flat disk. Uh, let us have... Uh... Okay. Kunwari, meron tayong disk. And this is the center, no? And we call uh, from that center to the edge of that disk will be a big letter R. And what we're going to do is to get the moment of inertia by integration. Ang sabi, I is equal to the integral of what? The integral of R squared dm. Okay. So, but what is that dm? Kunwari, ito raw ang center, kukuha tayo ng elementary strip. Okay. Ayan, elementary strip na yan. Tawagin natin dx yung taba niya. No? Ito, 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 ito. Dx. So, this will be dx itong uh, taba niya ngayon. And, uh, i-define muna natin itong dm. Sabi natin, the differential mass over the total mass is equal to the differential area over the total area A. What is the differential area of this one? Okay, this one. So, itong area nitong parang donut na to, if this is a... Uh, dx okay. so the differential area will be equal to dA is equal to 2 pi r the circumference okay 2 pi r but what is r r is actually x ano kasi kung mula rito hanggang dyan is x 2 pi x times dx yan yung differential uh, area niya and what is the total area of this buong circle the total area is equal to pi r squared yung r na yun, yung malaking r naman na yun, yun ano? so this one will be x so yan so nandiyan na tayo sa motion na yan we can now get dm. Malinaw na malinaw. So, uh, by cross multiplication, dm is equal to uh, da over a. Ito na yun. Ipasok natin dito. 2 pi x dx over pi r squared times m. Okay. So, dm over m dito yung m kanina dyan, ano? Eh, pinunta na natin doon. So, wala na to. Oh, malinaw, no? So, we can cancel pi. We can cancel pi. And, uh, ang matitira na lang, 2 pi x, uh, 2x uh, dx times m over r squared. Okay. Pero pwede natin ilabas yung mga constant ng uh, integration. Ano? So, uh, ganitong gawin natin. dm pa lang yan. Ano? dm. So, if that is dm, what will be our formula? Therefore, we will have here i let us uh, have I is equal to what? I is equal to two. Then merong m tayo m. Awag mo na. Pakita mo na natin. So the integral of r squared para hindi malito ang mga kapopong natin times 2x dx m 
but this r squared here we can actually call this as x kasi nga x na yung tinawag natin dun sa differential uh, ano natin ano differential area no so pinalta natin yung r squared ng x kasi nga magmula rito hanggang diyan ay x ano and m all over r squared okay yan na yung lalabas niyan ngayon what are the constant ayun mangyayari yung 2 i is equal to 2 pwedeng ilabas yung m pwedeng ilabas yung r squared pwedeng ilabas mga constant yan is equal to mm, x cube x cube dx okay so x cube dx yan ngayon ano yung ating limits o, kayo na ang uh, humula kung anong limits natin we are integrating the whole thing so from 0 to r tama from 0 to r okay we're now ready to integrate therefore we have here i i is equal to what 2m over r squared uh, 2m over r squared yan yung i uh, is equal to uh, we integrate now times uh, x to the fourth over 4 four from 0 to r So, therefore, i is equal to 2m over r squared. Okay. And then we have r to the fourth over 4 minus 0 na yun, ano? Minus 0. Therefore, i will be what? So, this is r to the fourth over 4 tapos r squared to cancel yung dalawa may natirang dalawa this is 2 and this is 4 may natirang may natirang dalawa is equal to the moment of inertia is equal to m r squared may natirang 2 doon over 2 so yan po yung uh, moment of inertia ng disk Tingnan nyo na lang kung tumatama, ano? That will be the moment of inertia of the disk. So, yan. Rotated about the cent center. Perpendicular to the board. Okay. So, ganun lang lagi. Ganun lang kasimple lagi ang pagkuha ng integral. Ang key factor lang naman yung pagkuha nitong dm, ano? So, sa DM, ulit, ulitin natin. Pag nakuha nyo na itong pagkuha ng DM na to, yung integral naman is everything about mathematics na, no? So, uh, analysis lang ang uh, importante pag nakuha na itong DM. Uh, you can actually, kapag ka-solid yung sphere, you can get differential volume over total volume. Saan ba nakukuha ito? Ulitin natin. Saan nakukuha itong 2 pi x dx for the second time? Slow motion. Burahin natin. Burahin natin. Ano? Oh, slow motion. Dm over m is 2. The differential area over area. So, uh, dito natin ilagay. Dm. Dm is equal to DA cross multiplication multiplied by M over A but what is the uh, the differential area is uh, 2 pi R 2 pi R yun uh, the circumference 2 pi but this is X 2 pi X and the thickness will be DX times M over what is A A is pi 
r squared the area of the whole uh, dish therefore that is pi r squared and then cancel cancel na lang yung mga kung ano mo makakancel dyan and then pinasok na natin dun sa integration everything will be and then everything will fall, fall into its place kapag nandun na integration na lang yan pasok mo yung limit saan yung limit 0 to r ok so ito lang ang critical dyan ito ito ito, ito, ito. and the rest will be uh, purely mathematics purely mathematics na po yan so linawal lang natin to i is equal to 2m over r squared r to the fourth over 4 minus 0 ayan yan and everything will be mood and academic ok, nakatatlo na tayo no? siguro mga isa o dalawa pang mga solid uh, particle o halimbawa, itong board na to if we are going to rotate it about this axis so pag practice nyo no? uh, nakakita kayo ng bola rotate about the axis itong mga ganito, nag, nag practice na tayo no? kanina, doon sa gitna tapos doon sa dulo for example, meron tayong isang uh, bagay. Halimbawa ay uh, meron tayong uh, calculator. Okay. So, itong calculator na to, we want to rotate it about this axis. Pwede. Or we want to rotate it about this axis. Pwede rin. And we want to rotate it about this axis here. Pwede. So, pwede yung paglaruan na mag-integral kayo sa isang bagay iba-ibang axis of rotation at mapapatunayan nyo na iba yung moment of inertia na ano uulitin ko ang principle ng moment of inertia malaki ang kaugnayan sa axis of rotation mga kahit parehong object yan pag sa ibang axis mo nirotate magkaiba yung kanyang moment of inertia kasi moment of inertia is defined as the ability of an object to resist any change in angular velocity. Eh, kapag lumalayo po yung object doon sa axis of rotation, mas bumibigat po yun. Mas lumalaki po yung moment of inertia kasi directly proportional po yan sa R squared. Anyways, nakakatatlo na tayo. No? So, uh, I think for ease of uploading, Pwede na natin muna tigilan dito and then I'll be back with another two more uh, examples with uh, moment of inertia. And I do hope mas uh, mabilis natin na uh, ipapaliwanag ngayon ano, dahil uh, gumagamit na tayo ng pentel pen ano, hindi na katulad dati na nga lang uh, pardon the uh, uh, limitation of the space of my uh, whiteboard. Okay, pero uh, sa tingin ko naman, mas, uh, mas mabilis to dahil uh, nahihirapan ako doon sa mouse. Nga lang, mas maliwanag talaga doon sa computer uh, screen narration. Diba? Anyways, uh, kapag ka naman saan tayo sa numbers, at alam ko naman madali niyong masusundan yan. Ayan, ganyan po. Uh, integral of so this is uh, the integral of from 0 to r ano? from 0 to r from 0 to r okay so i guess by now uh, ang tanging uh, take away ko lang sa inyo ay uh, mag practice kayo halimbawa may libro kayo nakita rectangular in shape pag practice nyo sukatin nyo ng uh, ruler and then uh, tingnan nyo i-rotate nyo sa tatlong axis iba ibang axis yan x y and uh, uh, Z axis. So, uh, maging practice ninyo. So, nagdawa natin yung mga sphere, spherical, uh, sphere, hollow sphere, or hollow, uh, hollow object, cylindrical, yan. Okay. I guess by now, sana nakatulong if you have any more uh, uh, questions. I think, uh, mukhang tatagal yata po ito talagang ating uh, lockdown na to kasi, uh, Parami-parami ng parami yung ating uh, mga cases. 
At kahit na tayo ay mga GCQ, eh, talagang hindi tayo po pwede kasi mga mass gathering tayo eh, mga institution, uh, siguro uh, mag-utay-utay na tayo dun sa suma, no? Kung wala po kayong mga resources, kung mga GCQ naman, uh, meron naman sigurong papayagan ng mga tinatawag natin mga computer shops or kahit sa mga cellphone po ninyo mag-upload uh, na kayo ng Zoom and siguro ang pinakamaganda ko nalang magagawa is mag-offer ako ng uh, mag-offer po ang mga teacher ng uh, particular na oras bawat section ganun ang nakikita kung pwede mangyari sa atin particular na oras, bawat section, magsuzoom tayo for one hour, two hour for the, uh, for the classroom discussion. Ngayon, kapag ka may mga tanong, doon na lang natin sasagutin. But ito ay supplemental na to, no? Ang kagandahan nito, you can, uh, you can play, you can pause, you can copy, you can replay. Yan. Ang may papayo ko rin nga po pala para hindi na rin ako nahihirapan kasi iya na rin ako dun sa mga leaders hindi ko naman po kasi talaga ugali na uh, sumali sa mga GC ng mga estudyante uh, yung mga leaders sa kanila ko lang pinapasa to ang pinakamaganda mag-subscribe na lang po kayo dun sa ating uh, sa aking uh, YouTube channel na pang educational uh, media pag po yung uh, pang uh, travel and tours yung pong pang educational media alam po ng mga mga section leaders ninyo na may link sa akin uh, yung mga yung aking uh, youtube channel na yun kasi nangyayari po sa atin isesend ko pa po sa messenger nila or sa facebook bago pa ipapasa sa inyo kasi hindi ko po talaga ugali na sumali din sa mga GC ng bawat sections to give you some privacy, siyempre. Ngayon, uh, gano'n na lang, katulad sa electrical, meron tayo si Manila, sa mechanical, si Doria, si Junsei and sa ECE nandun si uh, JP okay. and then si Consignado sa, sa computer sila lang yung merong access sa akin sila yung kaunaan na ng problema kasi pagka ganun mamaya naipasa ko na nga rin sa kanila syempre busy rin sila yung cascading ano? mas maganda mag subscribe na kayo dun sa channel wala naman pong bayad yung subscription wala naman din na uh, makakaltas sa inyo or kung ano man ano. and hindi ko naman po i-monetize yung aking uh, channel na yun uh, para lang po yung dito sa ating uh, sa ating online learning kasi nga po uh, tinamaan tayo nitong ating uh, COVID and uh, for your information na uh, the direction and the decision of uh, the Commission of Hi on Higher Education is to push through with the semester with the uh, implementation of uh, the alternative learning, flexible uh, learning scheme. Oh, so, ito na po yung uh, isa sa mga flexible learning scheme na ating, uh, na ating kinakaharap. So we have, we really have to adjust Okay. Yung mga estudyante na wala pang mga, wala pang mga Zoom, uh, actually, nagkaroon na ako ng announcement last month na mag-download mag, uh, ng Zoom kasi libre din naman po yun. Wala rin naman pong bayad. Mas mahal pa nga yung ML. So, uh, Zoom and then we will be uh, doing our live uh, interactions uh, with Zoom. Okay, with this, uh, nabigay ko na lahat ng mga further announcements. 
yung mga posibleng mangyayari nandito na rin yung mga kung paano natin sinusold yung ating mga integration practice practice lang po tayo and uh, I see you next video According to your word, Lord, we, your people, who are called by your name, we humble ourselves, we seek your face, and turn from our wicked and sinful ways. May our humble cry and confession find the same favor as generations before us have found. We give you thanks and praise in anticipation. Lord, what you have done among your people before, we ask you to do it again. Do it in us. Make a way. God will make a way.